What's up guys? Welcome to the channel and thank you for tuning in. So Blueface responded to the backlash that he was receiving after he had pregnant women in his music video. So he posted to his Instagram story and said, I'm disgusting. He then said, y'all would cheer for dot dot dot, basically saying Krishan because you know she's pregnant. But bash the Knicks for doing the same while getting paid. That's why I don't F with the fans. Y'all pump one and degrade the Knicks for doing the same, shaking my head. Blueface then says, bunch of females shaking it in my video. Y'all mad, but a be pregnant on the DJ booth, shaking it to pound town for free. Y'all cheering, I'ma keep bleeding y'all with the truth. He then says, you guys slash fans are the same reason for her demise, hype up stupidity for her, but then downplay it for the next pregnant bee, making the coin, make it make sense, I'ma be the same ninja tomorrow on SY. Blueface then said, now it's disrespectful and y'all feelings heard about it, tell it to the judge. He then says, this why I said my baby mama will watch the kid. I made more plans for the baby than her and this is the video that he posted. But I get that because I have a kid too. I see. So yeah, you, you do you want the kid? The he can yeah. have a kid with some. Yeah, what, what's our delivery? He then says, why you keep talking about rock? The B live in my house. I own the B. Y'all tell me stop talking about some I own seven tattoos in. Blueface then says, you don't own her. Is your name on it? He says, yes. Now, he's saying that he owned Krishan basically because Krishan got his name tattooed on her like seven different times. Well, you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions on that down in the comment section below. Now, we're going to move on to the next topic, which is about Ari Fletcher allegedly dumping Moneybag Yo. So you guys know Moneybag Yo is about to release a mixtape or album, so he's on a press run. So he did a podcast interview with Angie Martinez and revealed that he cheated on Ari Fletcher about seven months ago. I'm human. Like, people go through this now. They, yeah. they, they, they just don't want to, they ain't going to get on here with Angie Martinez and, and say what they did because they don't want to face backlash or they don't want to do that. Man, I'm, I'm, I'm human. I'm not perfect. I didn't, I didn't done stuff. Is like, this recent? This is um, recent. Probably, probably about... Recently. seven months ago we healing um, right now we 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 on the road to we moving forward you know what i'm saying we moving forward we healing right now so people on social media noticed that money bag yo tweeted and said as soon as i said i need her love that's when she went ghost on me with the broken heart emoji then ari fletcher tweeted and said the longer you hold on to something slash someone that hurts you the more pain you'll endure in the end let go and save yourself One person in the comment section said he was just telling the world he cheated on her lol he just embarrassed her mad crazy yes she is mia someone else said this promo getting old and another user said here they go every single time he drops new music you think they have a different game plan for new releases so basically people feel like every time Moneybag Yo is about to drop new music him and Ari start a fight or they break up so he can get attention to his music but you guys do you feel like they broke up or do you feel like they taking a break let me know your thoughts and opinions on both of these topics down in the comment section below Make sure you like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and as always, thanks for watching.